I'm Jamie Orr. It is Thursday at 10 a.m. Uh, this video is going up as soon as I possibly can because it's about time to go to SEMA. Um, today's video is brought to you by Suspension Source, uh, home of SolarWorks Suspension, uh, also the biggest distributor of KW ST Belltech in the USA, KW Glenn on Instagram. It's one of my best friends. Uh, he owns a company and he will be in Vegas helping me with all of the silliness. When I try to drive there, which is about 11 hours away. All right, Atlas. Atlas is pretty much together. Uh, Douglas, uh, the painter, has, uh, was up here yesterday, uh, helped me with a lot of trim, and he bolted all the body panels onto the Golf 3. So the Golf 3 is fundamentally like looking like a car, but, you know, obviously missing some things. Like all of the glass, all of the seals, the entire interior, everything. Um, oh, you can see there, I did, uh, I couldn't find a good door. So I took a door off my yellow Harlequin. That yellow door is from another Harlequin. And I painted it red. Douglas painted it red because I just could not find a rust-free mint condition door. Um, so I'll find a new old stock one for the one out there and restore it later. Um, all of these parts have to get bolted on. There's the wheels, side trim, there's from Classic Parts in Germany, um, Volkswagen Classic Parts, there's brand new window seals, FCP Euro, there's brand new wiper blades, there's some of the in seat parts, the, their seats are, I assembled the rear seats when I got them maybe a week ago, the fronts, well there's the piece of foam for the front, so the plan right now is I put windows in it, <laughs> Uh, put the brand new seals from Volkswagen Classic Parts in it. Just make it watertight and look complete exterior. And then put all the other parts in it and just drive it. Well, put it on the trailer and pull it cross country behind the Atlas, which is now almost very, very ready. The entire front end is done. All of the side trims are done. I have not test driven it on the new suspension, which is <laughs> low. But it seems to clear, so we might be okay. The interior, Black Forest Industries, Joe from Black Forest Industries drove up. The interior is absolutely incredible. So this is a uh, aftermarket material made in Turkey and lots of resellers for it. But Black Forest Industries bought some up and stitched it in. Kelly, actually, Kelly, if you've ever bought a handbrake boot from Black Forest Industries, here's a very custom one. It is uh, hand-stitched by Kelly at Black Forest Industries in their headquarters. And if you've ever bought a shift knob, they are now all CNC made on their like massive Haas machine, like Haas F1 in Black Forest Industries headquarters. Uh, Joe and Kelly, um, not actually a husband and wife, they literally do all of this with the team there, but Kelly does all the stitching. So they uh, they did all of this, been working on it for weeks and weeks, and then Joe drove up yesterday, two days ago, and worked through the night getting everything done. The door cards match everything. This is the first place I'm actually showing all of this. Um, the shift knob, I have the very original Black Forest Industries stuff. Oh, there's carpets for that one. There's the rear bumper for the Golf. They made me this one five years ago um, for the junkyard rescue car actually no this was five or six years ago for the first harlequin that i ever restored um and then i took it out to california and drove it home in the junkyard car so this one's going in there but there's also an automatic or dsg style shifter in there i don't i should put this not back there i need to start moving things towards the car so that when i'm leaving i don't leave anything behind um okay so that's all happening there uh, big news is trying to get rear glass for the the Golf. The original glass um, kind of went missing when we're looking for it. We don't know exactly what happened. If it got thrown out or something, it could have been damaged and I did throw it out. I'm not really sure. This really is really back together. We've got the Muddy Buddy protection mats in the back from Volkswagen because it's going to be loaded up in parts. This is an Uttinger body kit for the Mark 8 Golf GTI. It did not arrive in time before that car got trucked out. Not my fault, um, just SEMA things. So it's here, it's going in the back of the Atlas and I will tow it across and install it in Las Vegas. I'm going outside 
and I have a parked car. It's an explosion, it's everywhere. So before I leave, I have to tidy that up. Uh, the trailer, the trailer is a custom ordered 14 foot uh, steel wheel. It used to be long to the owner, or the, sorry, one of the presidents of the MG Owners Club. Um, I bought it from them. Um, Dan, who is coming out to Vegas as part of my crew to help, I uh, went over it, straightened everything, welded up a couple of things, painted it, so it's all looking great. Um, Rotiform are part of the Wheel Pros group. They sent out some alloy wheels, which we were going to color match. Unfortunately, um, the offset was too low and they stuck out too far. So I'm trying to um, find some nicer Volkswagen hubcaps for it. Um, so that's going, that's going on the back of the Atlas with the golf on it. Um, so right now my tasks are to, hello SCP Euro. Uh, my tasks are make this watertight, make this complete, get all of the new seals in, get the front end on, get everything somewhat in there. I'm not going to be wiring it up here. So I'm gonna take all the wiring, my wiring tools, everything else with me, uh, the new um, upgraded fuel pump, everything else is just gonna come with me and I'm gonna have a couple of days out there. And it's going on the Hoonigan display, Hoonigan out front for their 10th anniversary at SEMA, our 10th anniversary, um, who actually, Hoonigan is now part of Wheel Pros, which also owns Rotofarm. Connect the dots, people. Um, this is going to be out there, and I think there's nothing more Hoonigan than wiring your motor swap at the SEMA show on the Hoonigan display. Whatever. After this, um, after that, we're going to go down to LA for about five days. Um, Hoonigan are doing a cars and coffee for Volkswagen Audi only at their new burn yard. So this car <laughs> will be down there. Um, so I have plenty of opportunity to keep going. For right now, though, I'm just going to throw this up on YouTube. Um, thanks for everyone that's following along. Thanks for everyone for the, the support, for the awesome comments for everyone that's been coming up and help. It's been a bunch of people. Um, Peter, Dan, Arno, uh, a bunch of people. Um, I am starting to lose my mind a little bit <laughs> more than usual. Um, is this too much? Have I bitten off too much? Stay tuned. Ah, see the crudge. Yay. Yeah, they're going to do it. Who yeah, I'm, I'm going to be there unless I am not But whatever. Atlas is pretty dumb. Um, just just going to bolt on like more complicated things with electrics and things. Anyway, for now, wash your hands, wash your cars, follow along on social if you care. <laughs> Bye.